Greetings, YouTube. I know that some of you are frustrated because it's difficult to get shards quickly, unlike past months of the side quest this month. And I don't want to dismiss that complaint. I also know several of you are frustrated because the game is actually more broken for you this month than it was last month, despite the fact that last month was when Kabam apologized with five different compensation packages regarding dexterity and parry. Uh, I know from my perspective and my account that the game crashes every five to ten minutes at times, especially when I'm doing the arena. And also, maybe most frustratingly, it still has that crazy lag. And I know I don't play on the newest iPhone, I play on the iPhone 10, but some of you who do play on the newest iPhones tell me you still have crash problems and lag problems regardless of the processor. So, with that being said, I also love that this month we get some really inexpensive, affordable daily Bugle store prices and nothing is more affordable given the price tag than the 5 star Nexus this month. I know for somebody like me, it's going to be fun to open and it was fun to open and I got somebody in my Nexus in the last 24 hours that I never thought I would see in a Nexus. But this summoner here, Mr. Avenger, is level 46. Now, his chance of getting a 5-star Nexus is almost impossible given that he's just level 46. But uh, thanks to this side quest, he knows he can. Now you can see his roster is still very developing. I mean, the second row of his 5-stars, Quake is at PI of 3,600. Doom is his best champ. Maybe that's rank 5. And because you're level 46, you know you're still missing a ton of mastery points. So he's got Doom, War Machine as a 6-star, Warlock, Venom the Duck. Uh, not great. War Machine, by the way, is his only 6-star. So this is a desperately developing roster. But the Daily Bugle store gives this kind of player some hope. So purchases the 5-star Nexus for 900 By the way, I gotta say, if you're wondering, how do I get to 900 pretty quickly? I mean, I guess it's not quick quick, but I just do 5 duels with my uh, OG Vision against like a, a 1 or 2-star. First I did uh, Punisher 29.9, and now I'm gonna do Guillotine 29.9, and you get 750 after that, which is a crazy amount, like so generous. So do that, and beat like Spider-Man 2099 and uh, Penny Parker and like the two or three easiest difficulties and you're more than there for your Nexus. All right. Check this out. Man-Thing, Red Goblin, or Aegon. All new champions because of course it's a level 46 account. But, uh, and by the way, it's zoomed out a little bit because of the way that this guy shot it. I think the in shot app sometimes does this on the recording i don't know um but regardless Aegon. he got Aegon for his account someone that once he can awaken him he can use forever now the question is does he have an awakening gym okay he can upgrade him all right awakening gems this is flying but he's got 22 skill sig stones and 33 generics. So he, if he was able to awaken him, he could take him to Sig 56. Does he have an awakening gem or other six stones? 103 six stones. Bro, where the heck did you get those? How many red are you doing too? 19 more. Wow. Well, I don't know if you can awaken him. And next time, I would highly recommend you figure out a better way to record the aspect ratio of your game to where it's at least 720p. Uh, not everybody can be 1080. But, uh, man, what a great example of how this guy would not have had a chance to get Aegon on his roster anytime soon, certainly with the Nexus. But for such an inexpensive price, Kabam's really targeting these kind of accounts this month to progress, and I think that's fantastic. My channel, as always, is as much of a voice for the middle tier, middle class progressing player as it is for the upper class player. For everybody that's been playing for five years, I like talking about people who've been playing for five months. And who knows how long this guy's been playing, but at the same time, it's really, really encouraging to see this luck 
Sorry that it was a little smaller, but we still got to uh, give him a shout out and show progression, and that's so important with this video. Have a good one, YouTube, and thanks again to this subscriber and summoner for sending this video into the channel to commentate.